you know, you can't talk about you without talking about your work ethic. And Chad Reed himself said he's never gone up against anybody who is as talented as you. Mm -hmm. And you have this work ethic about you. Borderline insanity is what I've read and, and heard. It's not right. me saying it. But you also say you know what you're not good at. How do you challenge that? Because if you're very much always winning and you have all these amazing accolades, but you're also embracing what you're not good at. What are you not good at and that you've embraced it? Ooh, I mean, there's a lot of things that I'm not good at. I mean, if you want to start from a broadcast perspective, that's what we're talking about is, um, you know, like I wish I wish my vocabulary was better straight mm. up. I, I And I and, and truth be told, and I get beat up a little bit for that. Um, my wife helps me out a lot also on that end to, uh, of, of being better in that regard. She's um, ridiculously but, smart. She's so yeah, smart. Yeah. 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 She, she is. Uh, yeah. She's, she's got it going on. So um, like, I wish like critiquing myself, I wish I was better there. I work on it. I don't work on it like I probably should. Um, but in truth, but truth be told, I've never had great vocabulary, even when mm -hmm. I was a little kid going through school. Uh, it was, that was always really hard for me. Um, don't need a sympathy card or anything, but it, it was, I had to really work on that extra hard for tests and exams rather than it be math or something like that. Uh, but back when I was racing, um, you talk about talent. I had a lot of talent for sure, but I had more work ethic than I had talent. And, uh, so like supercross, supercross was always hard for me. So I had to really, really work at it. And I had to know where I, w I wasn't going to make big gains. Mm -hmm. uh, I had to realize that so I could focus on other areas to be better. Like there was only certain, you know, certain speeds or certain, a certain level that I was going to reach on, on said supercross obstacles. So I would work really hard in that area, but I'd work just as hard in other areas to mm -hmm. offset, you know, offset where I, where I needed to be better. So, um, to, to parallel it for you, uh, that that's where, that's where I wasn't good. And, and outside of that, you know, just each day I wake up and I wonder how I'm going to be better. How, how can mm -hmm. I be a better person? Um, you know, and, and not be judgmental towards anybody and just always have a positive outlook. And, and I tell my kids this all the time. It's like, you know, they're, they're teenagers and they want, you know, they, they, they got comments and I'm just like, Hey, don't worry about the comments. Who cares mm -hmm. about it? You focus on you. You do the best that you can do every single day. You wake up and you say, how can I be the best version of me? Mm -hmm. And, uh, you know, don't worry about, or don't cast judgment on anyone. And, uh, I, that, that's what I, that's my everyday plan and what I do. And, and it helps me. So, um, yeah. That's, I mean, that, that's how I try to be better in just life. That's how I try to be better in broadcasting. And that's how I tried to be better in racing. 